Codex Serafinianus by Luigi Serafini, I'm guessing. He's Italian. This is a pretty big book. Look at this. It's a nice big book. And it had it feels pretty solid, sort of a cloth bound thing. Here's the <clears throat> Fine, Codex Serafinianus. Where's the back? It's a hefty book. It's hefty because of its size, but also because the paper is very thick paper. It's really good production quality. This is the 20th anniversary edition. Um, and it comes with a ribbon. So what is it? Well, it's been described as a um, an encyclopedia of another world. So imagine that you have, well, it's, it's another world, an alien world or another universe where everything that's there is different from everything that's here. There's some similarities, but it's different. And then this book explains all the things, except the problem is that it explains it in a language, you know, at least a script that no one can decipher. So this is just to give you an idea of the thickness of the paper. It's really quite, quite thick and feels really good. Uh, so every, every page is more uh, stuff that doesn't really make sense to us. I mean, what's it actually saying? Um, we don't know. And then the, there are sections throughout. So here's like a plant section. Um, but of course, these plants are very, they are unknown to us. They've all got their names. At least I assume their names. And I, you know, I don't know. That's, I don't know. So we go to another, see I've got the, where's the ribbon? So here's like a table of contents, I guess, of the next section. And you can go through it, I don't know what this section is. Sort of creatures? And the only explanation you're gonna get is right here. And some of it is pretty, and some of it is not pretty. It's just bizarre. This is a whole section on legs, <laughs> rather, you know, things with legs. See, here's your explanation. Here's a pretty good explanation of what's going on here, as you can see. Um, and if you don't like that explanation, that's too bad, because that's all you're going to get. It's all sort of like legs things with legs these things with legs apparently have something to do with the gondola there i don't know or if that's a gondola i don't know anyway so look it's uh, nuts and the whole book is like this and it's really cool if you're the kind of person who would find it really cool it's just very, very strange. No idea what this is. This, this might be famous people, or it might be just different body types or facial types. No idea what's going on here. Um, but I can see that this person uh, has a pen for an arm. And this person was stabbed with a pen. I don't get it. Weapons, I suppose. Okay, uh, look, we can go, we can do this all day long. It's something like 400 pages of all kinds of stuff. And to me, I, I don't know, I love it. I really love it. Just pick it up and flip through and, and just go, what? I mean, what, are, what, what's happening here? What's going on here? Fried egg? 
but what's happening? The paper is is textured. It feels so good. It's you know this thick, clothy kind of feeling to it. Um, look, I could talk about it all day. You get the idea. It's nuts. Either you're the kind of person who would find this interesting and cool, or you're the kind of person who would you know think this is crazy and I don't want this in my life. And I know which way I land. So we have the Codex Serafinianus by Luigi Serafini.